GPT-5 is on the way and it will be free for people to use. That is the big news that is coming out of a tweet from Sam Altman. And are we gonna make a full video about this tweet? Yes, we are. Get ready, because we're gonna go through everything that Sam Altman says is happening with OpenAI's roadmap, what that means for the rest of AI, and kind of maybe why this is happening now. Let's get into it. This is the big tweet where Sam Altman has gone forward and laid out the OpenAI roadmap update for GPT 4.5 and 5. Now, this is actually a pretty significant piece of news. And we know there's been a lot of drama happening right now with Elon and Sam, and that's a big deal. But what's in this tweet is pretty significant when it comes to the future of AI in general. First and foremost, we are getting a GPT 4.5 and a GPT-5. Both of these have now been confirmed from Sam himself. This is what's coming next. It says right here that ChatGPT 4.5 will ship next. This was the model they were referring to as Orion. So if you've been following this channel for a while, you know Orion was a big deal and it will be their last non-chain of thought model. This means that the reasoning models that have been separate from OpenAI's launches so far, the O1, the O1 Mini, O3, all those sorts of things, they will be integrated into further models. What does this mean going forward? It means a unified large language model plus a reasoning model. GPT-5 is going to be a system that integrates a lot of their technology, including O3. But this is kind of a big deal. We will no longer ship O3 as a standalone model. So we may end up waiting longer for that. I think this is a shot across the bow to companies like DeepSeek or even uh, Mistral, which is that the free tier of ChatGPT will be getting unlimited access to GPT-5 at the standard intelligence setting. This is massive. This is a big deal for the world at large because the vast majority of people that use these AI systems are going to be using free ones. And in this instance, it looks like OpenAI is opening the door. Now, does that mean you don't get anything for Plus or Pro subscriptions? No. Obviously, what they're saying here is that if you have a Plus subscription or a Pro subscription, each level of that is going to get you the higher level reasoning model, which we could assume going forward. This was the way that it was going to work. But let us talk now about what this means for the AI space at large. This is Sam Altman and OpenAI saying, here is where we are going. Elon, up yours. This is the direction we are traveling. And also this is about opening the door to the largest possible footprint that OpenAI can have as a company. If you are going to offer GPT-5 free to everybody, that's a very big deal. The biggest question you might be asking is when, right? When are we getting GPT-4.5? When are we getting GPT-5? When are we gonna get all this for free? Well, Kim Moen Simmons, who's a great follow on X, asked specifically, any ETA for GPT-4.5 or five? And Sam just said, weeks slash months, which is kind of the answer we've been getting for a while here. But again, that is not that far away. Now, GPT 4.5 is gonna come first. We'll see what happens with that. We'll also see how much better it is and everything else. I'm personally still waiting on the imaging tools that come out of that, which is a big deal. GPT-5, I would assume, is coming later. But the fact that they are talking about GPT-5 means that they do have this in-house right now and they are working on it, at least I would assume that much. Overall, I think this is a great thing because a unified system means that we'll be able to do multiple different sorts of things. And also, it gets so confusing seeing what these names are. I mean, I don't know how many times I've had to explain the naming systems at Gemini or the naming systems even in the O1 models to people that don't understand what's going on with this. So I am very bullish on this idea of unifying into one model or a small number of models. We will see how this timeline works out, whether or not Sam will deliver on these promises. But this is kind of a big statement, especially with all the Elon wants to buy OpenAI drama that we're gonna get into in tomorrow's show. We'll see you then.